Hey, I feel like high and relaxed. You shouldn't talk. Well, then don't film me. My least favorite place, cause Kim. We're having memory card tr troubles again. What else is new? We put in like a bigger memory card in our camera and we were taking some videos down in the distillery and um, when we went to play them back, they weren't playing. And we literally drove to like three different stores, but if you're from Toronto, you know how hard it is to get around because there's so much traffic. And I just feel like now we're just wasting time. So I'm hoping that doing the videos on the cell phone will be okay. Like thank God Kale has like a new iPhone. It's an iPhone 6. And it's six, pretty clear. So it's pretty clear. It seems actually clearer than our camera. <laughs> Yeah, so from here on out, it's gonna be iPhone footage, so we apologize if it's not as good a quality, but we tried our best to get a memory card. Long story short, hope you enjoy. Oh yeah. Happy holidays everybody. to the Christmas market. Definitely got to come to the Christmas market in the distillery district. Yeah, it's so beautiful. There's a lot to see. It's yeah. very good. Very Christmassy. Yeah. Heating up some refried beans. enjoy this burrito bowl for lunch. So I just got home from my workout class. Um, I really gave it my all. Usually I feel like I stay pretty safe with the weights and because um, I'm scared like if I up it I'll get bulky but I know that's not the case so yeah we also did like some different exercises that we haven't done in a long time so it's really good because we're like getting working other muscle groups that you know maybe we haven't touched on in a while so yeah I really like these classes. It's like a great way for me to like get out for an hour and not really like think about anything. And um, you know, I've met some friends there too, just because it's like a bunch of ladies from the community and you know, friends of friends and stuff like that. So it's really nice. I really enjoy going. And for dinner, I made enough lunch um, so that I could just heat it up for dinner um, because I knew that I had a bunch of stuff to do tonight, like chores, and I'm going to film another video for our channel on Wednesday, for Wednesday, sorry, so I need to film that tonight. So yeah, 
That's what I'll be doing. I'll be heating up my food, filming the video, and cozying up in bed and watching YouTube. We're here at Lisa's favorite place. Costco! And my least favorite place, <laughs> Costco! <laughs> So we decided to return our old camera because we purchased the Canon G7X because yeah. we saw so many awesome YouTube videos and it just looks crystal clear. And this one was so grainy and the audio was a bit, Crappy. I don't know, fuzzy and stuff like that. And so. also we, we spent a little bit of money on it, but it's like our Christmas gift to each other. Yeah. And with the money we're getting back from that camera, it's not that bad really my paranoia is sinking in I've like triple checked the stamp box like a thousand times she thinks that like the FBI is in <laughs> gonna interrogate her or something it's so it's true like... I literally rehearsed all morning what I'm gonna say about this goddamn camera so I successfully Kale successfully returned the camera and I didn't get interrogated by the FBI so we just got to the mall to do some Christmas shopping and we grabbed some dinner. Oh yeah. Did you go juice? I got the... I'm not gonna lie, I had a burrito bowl before <laughs> this, but... Oh, this is my dinner. You know what? Whatever, a little snack size Jugo juice. It's called Mango Magic. It's like all mango and like tropical juices. It's so friggin' good. Exactly what I wanted. I'm gonna show you some Christmas shopping footage. And I gotta buy a sweet outfit for my press conference in London. London, England, darling. outfit for me I, I did get some pants but um, I don't know I, I, I'm, I have such a hard time buying fancy clothes he like, gets really overwhelmed I don't know what I'm looking for I'm not a fancy guy so yeah. what we're gonna do is we're gonna go online and just find some pictures of like guys style that he really likes and um, just kind of like mimic that I guess because I'm visual and like that's what I do for my outfits like if I see someone on Instagram I'm like oh I really like that outfit I'll try and find something similar and I think that's what we're gonna do for him yeah. and just plan every single day and lay all the outfits out accessories blah 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 and then that way it's easier and he's not overwhelmed and, and plus I'm tired and I want to get the out of this mall anyway Good girl. Good girl, Richardson. Oh, I got nine. I got nine, 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 nine. I don't know. Whoa, look. Mm-hmm. Look. Look how clear she is, Kale. Look. Can you see yourself? Yeah, I can. So this is our new camera. We took our old one back, so it went towards the, the total price. But let us know how you like the clarity of the new camera. I'm loving it so far. How do you look? I look great. I can't even <laughs> little, uh, little hairstyling. What a cocky. Good morning. Oh my god, this camera is so clear. Um, I feel like it's been a while since we vlogged in the morning and actually vlogged while we were both at work. I don't know, this past week has just been so incredibly busy. Um, just busy with the kids at the daycare and Kale's just been really busy with this up and coming project he's working on um, and he's actually going to London on Saturday so we're just like really really busy getting a lot of stuff done um, and you know it's like right in the holiday season so uh, last night we did some Christmas shopping but we did try to do some stuff around the nighttime because we feel like that's when we have the most time so uh, hopefully this vlog isn't too too boring for you guys but it should be okay. I also had a dentist appointment today and the only thing I can drink are clear liquids. I love breakfast. I don't know how I'm gonna get through the day. I have to, I can't eat eight hours before my appointment and my appointment's at 12.30, so. Ugh, wish me luck. Where's mama? Thank you. 
I'm so depressed, I'm so hungry, but I'm burning all my energy at this place. There's my family. Hey, girl. Hey. Just on the way to the dentist, <laughs> my mom is actually bringing me. Oh my god, I'm terrified. But thankfully I'll be getting laughing gas and a sedative to <laughs> relax me and I've made a playlist because I hate the sounds of the dentist. But um, yeah, I'm getting a tooth pulled and a few cavities filled, so wish me luck. Thought I would have support from Kale, who was supposed to call me about five minutes ago and I tried calling him about three times and he hasn't picked up. <sighs> I wish he would remember. Like zen out, like mm -hmm. I could fall asleep. So. Is it out? Almost. Almost. Okay. Open one. So how are you with pain usually? Pretty good or not so so? No, I'm good with pain. That's my girl, she made it through. <laughs> hey. Hi. I feel like high and relaxed. I fell asleep when I heard a thing and I was like, oh my doorbell. And I wanted to get up. I uh, You shouldn't talk. Well then don't film me. Keep your mouth shut. Talk. Keep your mouth shut. I can't. Now you're pissing me off. So I'm home from the dentist. <laughs> and this is all swollen. But, you know, he did a really good job. He did a really good job. And he really made my anxiety level go down. And I got some freezing, a sedative, and a little bit of laughing gas. And I didn't even feel the tooth getting pulled and I didn't even feel him do anything with the cavity. Honestly, it wasn't so bad. The only downside is that I'm starving and I, ha I still have to wait a little bit to eat because I have gauze because I had, I had to get some stitches, but it'll heal up soon, hopefully. Hey guys, so uh, I just wanted to talk a bit about um, how I'm feeling and how my uh, workout and weight loss progress is going um, the last couple well I'd say a week and a half um, I've been so busy trying to get ready get everything ready for this London trip that I've been putting off my workouts my days have been so chaotic and yeah I've just been I've just been skipping workouts basically it leads to sort of a snowball effect where you know I feel I feel down, I feel like if I'm not losing weight, then I'm gaining weight. I'm still eating healthy, and I'm still obviously 
you know, that's that's not going to change. But um, yeah, it's just last couple of weeks have been rough. So I've got a little bit of free time when I'm in London. So hopefully I'll be working out then. Um, and then when I get back, I'm going to hit it hard again. It's, it's sort of getting me down a little bit, but I'm just trying to sort of stay motivated and, you know, think about the positives, how I'm doing so much better than I was before. So yeah, that's what's up with me.